Hi, in this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to calibrate a portable refractometer. This is the model of the one that I'm going to be demonstrating. Right, here is the refractometer. It comes with this little screwdriver. There's your dropper and the calibration knob is sitting over here. So I just pull that open. Now, in order to do the calibration, you will need some distilled water. So here's the distilled water. Make sure your dropper is clean. I've got my distilled water poured in this bowl. All right, I've left this water out. The reason being is the ambient temperature influences the calibration measurement. So you can see the temperature of the bowl is 19 degrees centigrade. Right, and just checking the temperature of the prism, you can see that it is 20 degrees centigrade. Now I take one to two drops of the distilled water and put it on the prism. Right, now what I do is I wipe this clean. There may be residue of some other substances that were tested prior. Right, now I take one to two drops of the distilled water on the prism, close the daylight plate. Try not to have any bubbles there. Now leave this for about half a minute. The reason being is we want the temperature of the distilled water to get to the temperature of the refractometer. Right, just a note, the manufacturer recommends you only perform this calibration if your temperature is in the range of 50 degrees Fahrenheit to 86 degrees Fahrenheit. So that is about 10 degrees centigrade to 26 degrees centigrade. In this case, I'm well within that range. I'm at 20 degrees centigrade. Now what you need to do is look in the viewfinder and see if the blue shading is at the bottom line. In this case, you can see that the blue line is exactly on the line that says water line. So in this case, it is calibrated. If it wasn't, what you'd need to do is adjust the screw. So for example, when you look through the viewfinder, you see this. You see the blue shading is above the water line. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take my screwdriver, put it over there and turn it until that blue line until the blue shading meets that water line. Right, so there I've overshot. Right, so that's clockwise and I've overshot a bit. Now I'm going anti-clockwise just to calibrate. Right, so that is about right. You can see the shading and the water line is now in the same place. Right, so now you've calibrated your portable refractometer. Thanks for watching and cheers.